Welcome to my third part in my best first season guide. So this is where we left off in the village here. And let's continue on as we make our way over to where we're going to start building our town. I'm going to quickly go through here and check out what's there. And here we find a, uh, a cart and a bronze axe and some planks. I am overburdened, so I'm going to have to drop these planks on the road and pick them up later. Yeah. And just down the road, I saw some logs. So let's head over there and see what we can find here. And in here, we have a copper axe and some logs. So I'm going to drop these logs off here. Now I got too much axes and stuff, so I'm going to have to go back and sell it or drop something. You know what? I am just going to drop this copper axe right now. It'll stay here forever and it's on the road and in the common roadway. I'm going to pick it up later. So I am just going to make my way to the back to the town real quickly and sell this one because I'm going to need the inventory space. And on our way, we find another cart turned over here, and too bad we are full. I'm going to take the tools here, and I'm not going to be able to carry very much, so I'm going to have to drop some of this later on, obviously. But I'm going to hold on. No, I'm actually going to drop it right here, because I am, I am kind of too full. And I'll pick up this later with the other stuff. And I'm going to carry on now. And here is another cart. And we've got some wool fabric that is worth a lot. And there are the shears that go with it. Um, these are lightweight, so I think I'm going to hold on to them and sell them at the next possible time I can. But yeah, I'm trying to get to my town and get it built right away. So let's let's get there. Okay, as you can see, I found a place I'm going to drop my fertilizer and hopefully remember where it is later on. But this is where I'm going to start building my farmland. So to show you how I do it is, I have done it before, so I'm going to, I know where to line it up, is when you start your field, I find this little, little place right here, and this is like a corner right here. So I find this right here, and then I'm going to build my field 10 by 10 to make it nice and simple for myself. So I am going to go out... Those trees are going to be in the way, so I'm going to go from here and go out 10. Like, come on. Like there, there's 10. So I'm going to build that field right there. Now I'm going to build a second field right here. Yeah, fields, good job. Oh, yeah, start it right there, right beside it. And this one here, I think I have enough room to make it 10 out of 10 without clearing, clearing out anything else.
there we go. So there's my first field I'm going to make out of 100. And I do not know if I can... Uh, I'll, I'll check it out. But these fields, they cost money. They cost taxes every year. So you don't want to build them and, and keep them up, keep them alive. Yeah, 10 by 10. I can build another field here and it's and it's fine. So I lined it up properly. So now I can start worrying about building this here field. So that is the next thing I'm going to start doing now. Okay, I just remembered I'm going to need some more leather for some bags. So I, before I get dirty and I cannot talk to these villagers, I'm going to run over here to this tailor and buy some leather to make some leather bags. So I can seed and plow my crops. Well, not plow my crops, but seed them. So I'm going to make sure I have the uh, ingredients necessary. And I should have gone and killed some more uh, bear. I mean, uh, not the bears. Uh, some more uh, boars or uh, deer. And I hope she has leather on her. And she doesn't. Does she, does she sell leather bags? Does she sell bags at least? Uh, she sells a bag. She doesn't sell the weaker ones, so I am going to have to take a hit or take some time out farming to go get some leather. But I'm, I'll buy a bag. Have a good day. Yeah, I didn't need to waste my gold on that bag. She sells the simple bags, I just forgot it and I missed it. So just don't make that mistake and just buy the simple bags. But I need to go out hunting anyways and get some food later on. Okay, we got some level ups here in our things. And what you're going to want to take, of course, is skilled farmer. And you're going to want to max that one out as soon as you can. And for diplomats, you're going to want to take... Uh, diplomacy knowledge for that one but anyways I am ready to plow my fields well not plow them fertilize them
Okay, now that my fields are planted for now, I'm going to build a farm. And I'm going to stick the uh, farm right in the middle of the um, on my fields because the farming distance matters for your farm workers and stuff like that. The, the barn can't be too far away from the fields. That is why I did the middle field first. And that is why I'm going to stick it right here. Okay, this is where we want our house to be, close to the mine right here, and close to the storage area we're going to stick right here for our convenience. So I'm going to, this is why I'm going to build my house here. I'm not going to finish building it, because I don't, I want to finish building it with good materials, but I need, I need the location on where I want to put this right now. And I want to line it up so it's kind of equal with these cliffs right here, and as close as I can to them. I wish you could really zoom out better when doing this so that looks like an okay line to me yeah that's kind of okay so next I'm going to build a resource storage area right here as close as I can to here and have it aligned with this place right here so right like this and then over and I don't want that I don't want the ramp. Yeah, I like that. And closer, up higher. Not that close. Okay, that should be good enough. I want some space. Yeah, that's a good enough space for me and enough room to get up here so that is an okay placement for this okay I'm gonna go to continue and I'm gonna build this one here out right now Okay, as you can see here, I built a wood shed as a preferred uh, fifth building because as you can see here, um, under the management, you can only build five buildings. So I'm going to build a wood shed so I can have a actual build my house here with a proper roof on my house. And this will be my main house later on, but I can change it, everything here with the edit command and edit the roof. And I'm going to have my, yeah, I'm going to keep my doorway here right across from there. But I'm going to build everything out of stone. Oops, that was not a doorway. It should be a doorway. Yeah, doorway out of stone. And a nice window out of stone. 
and I'm gonna change everything around here out of stone and then go mining and then build it up. So I'm just gonna fast forward the rest of it now. Okay, and now I got my house done. So I had, to, as you saw, I had to go out hunting a little bit, and I forgot about my trap out there, which would have helped earlier on if I had some rabbit here. But you need lots of food, so I'm gonna have to go out hunting again. Maybe it's gonna be iffy on the timeline here if I'm gonna starve or not. And I have a few, I have like you know, 10, 15 minutes left before nightfall. And I have picked up everything and I have my uh, first part of my town done. I could add a road here. But what I'm going to do now is I am going to go pick berries. So I'm going to do that because um, if you watch my other videos, if you pick a whole bunch of berries and then you just drop them, or, you know, cabbages, for instance, and you drop them, they'll turn around in the next season. And I need fertilizer for the next season. So I'm going to stash some of these uh, items I don't need right now. And then I'm going to go out and get some berries. And maybe do some hunting. So I'm going to fast forward for the rest of this. But this is like basically the end of the first season for now. Unless I have more to say later on. But that is it. That is that is it for the uh, first start. So you're done. You have your farm done. You have uh, th th 100 crops out there. 
50 flax and 50 cabbage for the next season. I have a house here ready for another villager, so I can get another villager right now if I wasn't dirty and I had a bucket and I just built myself a cleaning station and clean myself and talk to a guy and have him come start working. But of course it's nighttime and he won't do any work anyways. But yes, that's the first villager you want to get is of course a guy getting all the wood for you so you can build to your heart's content later on. And now I'm going to go worry about my farm stuff. So I'm going to take a drink and then head off to get some berries. Okay, I am going to drop my berries right here. It is getting very close to the daytime and my berries have to be outside of my inventory on the ground for them to actually turn to rot. And it's not a very ideal location, obviously, but I am going to have to leave them there. And I'm going to pick a thing here, this one here. So I'm going to leave them here and mark this on my map so I know where to go and pick them up. Now I'll be able to find them because you, you, you use, the, uh, use the alt command you'll see it'll, it'll be a rot right here. I'm going to see how much more berries I can pick and maybe add to the pile. And that is it for the season. The first season is done. And I'll show you my inventory here. My unripe berries only went down to 50% right here. So I only have that stack of 800, which will turn into 80 fertilizer for me after I process that. So that's an 80 free fertilizer for this season. And of course I have all those cabbages, 50 of them. And my farming skill is already at 100% harvest for that, for those cabbages. So I can drop those cabbages and I'll get like, you know, a whole bunch of fertilizer. I don't know how much cabbages I'm going to pick out of a field of 50, but whatever they are, I'm just going to drop them all. And then the next season they'll be turning to rot and I'll have fertilizer for that season, which is free instead of actually running around and making it and buying stuff. So this is the end. If you want to see more, uh, add some comments to these videos here because I'm going to stop this right here and I'm not going to finish doing any more unless you want me to show you some more. So this is it for the series and I hope you got a good fast start for yourself as I just did my first season and that was the best start that I could manage, get a nice Nice good field of uh, crops ready to grow and my town is ready to start being built. And I am in, I'm in like, you know, I'm looking forward to like actually making a whole bunch of profit off that flax and the, all those cabbage seeds for the next seasons to come. So thanks for watching again.